lion, lion, look at everyone. Wow, look at that. Big male. Must be one of the Birmingham males. <laughs> what a nice surprise. Anyway, I was saying, I'm sure that was a honey buzzard, a European honey buzzard. Let's follow this lion. Oh, look at that. Hey? That is really nice. You can hear some impala alarm calling at him now. He's probably just moving into the shade. Let's see, he might go and lie down. And that's exactly what he's done. Just moved into the shade. His impala alarm calling very close to him. Hold on. Just position here for us. Here we go. Is that alright, Senzo? Can you get him from there? There we go. Lovely view of him. What a nice surprise. Pugs fanatic. <laughs> you asked when the when the lions roar, can we hear that rumble in the, in the ground? Well, that's not. No, I wouldn't say quite in the ground, but you can you can pick up on the vibrations though. Definitely, it's that loud. If you are close enough, if you are close enough, you can you can definitely feel the vibrations. And when you're sitting in a vehicle, you can hear it indeed. Now, just listen for a second. Um, let's make sure I ambient sounds turned up but you'll hear this impala alarm calling it's not too far I can't see him he's just behind a tree probably about 40 meters away but he's alarm calling at this lion let's see if he there we go do you hear that that's another snort so even though He's very close to the line. His alarm calling, they, he doesn't want to lose sight of the line. That's why that impala is standing, alarm calling at the line. He's warning any other animals that might be around. But as long as he keeps a, a good eye on the line, it, it's unable to stalk and hunt him. That's what the impala thinks. But this male looks quite full. Possibly one of the males that got to feed on that zebra yesterday. Belly does look full. He's panting quite heavily. He's probably been walking quite a bit. Like I said, that's the nice thing about wind or going into winter now. Even though it's almost nine o'clock, you still get a bit of movement from these predators because it is much cooler. Whereas in summer, when it's very hot, they'll be lying in the shade immediately. Oh, what a nice little surprise at the end of the morning safari. See how it's all happening. James had those wild dogs. Those lions just popped out. I wonder if there aren't any others around. I don't see. I've just seen him. And I'm also not sure if this is the male that was mating with that female the other day. Now, speaking of James and the wild dogs, he's still with them. Let's go see if they're running around. <laughs> 